thanks to Giants Netball and Origin Energy, we are here at Queenscliff Netball Club and we're about to bring good energy to all the young netballers and have a whole lot of fun. We're going to share a lot of tips on how we like to keep those little ones super engaged, have a lot of fun but also nail those skills. So we are about to get into it. One of the ways we love to keep our little ones engaged is by having a lot of fun. So tonight we have chosen a song challenge. So at any stage throughout the session, if the girls hear a specific song, tonight we've chosen a Harry Styles song, they have the challenge of partnering up with a friend, linking arms and going and running and hitting two goalposts and running back. It's always really cool to see them get right into it, be competitive, but also switch on and stay engaged in the drill. You can be as creative as you like and create any challenge with that little song as a twist to make it a lot of fun. Get your players into groups of four to six. The aim of this drill is to deliver chess passes to each teammate where the passer that was out the front joins the end of the line and the next person becomes the lead passer. The team then worms their way down the section of the court. Get your players into groups of four to six. The aim of this drill is to deliver chess passes to each teammate. The lead passer stands at the front facing the line. Once a player receives a pass, they duck down so the pass can go directly to the player behind them. Once everyone has had a pass, the passer at the front moves into the line and the back person becomes the lead passer. Get your players into pairs where they need a bib and a cone. This one's a race to carry the cone on your bib all the way to the transverse line and back. The first pair back is the winner. The purpose of the drill is to encourage teamwork and of course, to have a bit of fun along the way. Oh, yes, yes. <laughs> this game is go fetch. Get your players into pairs. One player has four cones. They run backwards and drop the cones one at a time for their other player to pick up. Together, they must make it to the end of the third and run back to the start arm in arm. The first pair back is the winner. The purpose of this drill is to work on the player's speed and reaction time. Have fun, 